Hi guys, welcome back to one more video. Many of you guys are following our Arduino tutorial playlist and we are getting good feedback. So thank you for that. We got few requests from subscribers to make video on the simulator for learning Arduino programming instead of actual hardware components. So recently I came across one online platform called Oakvi Simulator. So in this video, I'll show how to use this platform with simple demonstration. So first open Google and search for Oakvi Simulator. And click on this first website so in the same website you can work with different boards like Arduino ESP32 STM32 and Raspberry Pi so in my case I'll be showing the Arduino board so I'll click on this so already you can see some example projects so we'll start from scratch and select Arduino Uno board so in this window on the right side this panel is for making circuit and on the left side you can write your code just for demonstration i'll select some simple project like controlling the led bulb using single push button for that we need led and push button so here is the plus button to add the new component so i'll take led and push button LED will connect to pin 13 a negative terminal to ground you can select the wire and change the color if you want like this and also I'll do the connection for push button one pin goes to ground I'll make this also black and other pin to digital pin I'll connect to pin 7 so I'll keep this with this color so this is the connection to start with the code so this editor is exactly same as how our Arduino ID looks so I'll declare the pins connected for LED and push button setting the pin modes of both the pins And in the loop we'll read the button pin and using that data we'll toggle the LED bulb so if button is pressed you have to simply toggle one variable I've kept the name as LED state so finally using this LED state we have to write the LED pin with digital write function so that's it the code in order to start the simulation you can use this run button Okay, there is semicolon missing here the simulation has started so I press the button there it is turning on and again if I press it's going off so this is working as expected so till here we have used the components which are directly available so assume if you want to use any module which requires specific library installation so in Arduino board usually 
we go to library manager and install the required libraries but here it's very much straightforward you can go to library manager here and click on the plus icon and add the library you want as an example I'll add LCD module in this project to display the LED state so I'll be installing liquid crystal I2C library so to select and the library automatically gets added here so coming back to the circuit I'll take LCD module and make the connections quickly so this goes to ground VCC to 5 volts SDA pin to A4 and SCL to A5 so coming back to the code we have to include the liquid crystal I2C library and also we have to declare an object of class liquid crystal I2C so the coding is exactly same what we do in Arduino IDE there is no major difference so I'll directly print the state of the LED which is available in this variable so the code is done again I'll run on the simulation button so now the simulation is active and we can already see LCD started working and by default it's showing the state as 0 if I press the button LED turns on and state is going to 1 so this is how you can simulate and learn the Arduino projects virtually without having actual hardware components I'll also leave this platform link in the description box you can try it out I hope this video was helpful for further tutorials stay tuned and subscribe thank you for watching